What's going on guys, Nick Sap World here, and today guys we're going to be showing you how to downgrade your iPod Touch 3rd generation from iOS 5.1.1 to iOS 4.1. So, here's my iPod Touch 3rd generation. As you can see, it's a 3rd gen because it's how on iOS 5.1.1. And I'm doing this on a 64 gig. Serial number doesn't matter. So, let's get started. So, first you want to have your iPod Touch connected to your computer. As you can see, here mine is. So what you first want to do is put your iPod into DFU mode. So you do that by holding the home and power for 10 seconds. Then once you see the screen go off, wait two seconds, then continue to hold the home button, but release the power button for another 10 seconds or until iTunes detects it. So we're going to start by holding the home and power for 10 seconds. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 9, 10, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. As you can see, iTunes has detected an iPod in recovery mode. You just want to hit OK. Hold Shift on Restore iPod if you're on Windows. And if you're on a Mac, hold down the Option key. So you want to locate your iOS 4.1 IPSW. So here mine is. You want to select that and hit Open. It will, you will be asked, iTunes will erase and restore your iPod to iOS 4.1 and verify with Apple. You just want to hit restore and it's going to, going to begin to restore and I'll come back once this finishes. Okay, so that's finished restoring and now we're on the lock screen so we're just going to slide to unlock. And you, if you see the edit home screen, just hit dismiss. It's just telling you how to edit your home screen. So as you can see, it's the iOS 4 layout. Let me just brighten up the screen a bit. So we'll go to general about, and as you can see, iOS 4.1 is the exact same iPod, the 64 gigabyte third gen. And there, there we go. Now your iPod Touch third gen is now on iOS 4.1. So if you like this video, show me by leaving a like and subscribing. And thank you for watching. Bye.